We are inside the Javits Center for the New York Auto Show back for the first time since 2019. There are more than 700 cars that are here. A lot of electronic vehicles that you can take out for test runs for the first time inside the Javits Center. We're looking at now. I, this is the luxury of all luxuries. It is the Wagoneer and Nick Miles, most appropriate name ever, is the auto expert who's going to tell us about it. I, this car is, it is the definition of luxury. Absolutely. America's third luxury brand. So we have Cadillac, we have Lincoln, and now we've added a new luxury brand in America called Wagoneer. It's part of the Jeep family. I was going to say, I saw Wagoneer and I thought, okay, this is Jeep. This is Jeep. So it does everything Jeep does with going off road and all of that. Absolutely. And this is the Wagoneer L and that means L for extended or long and it gets an extra 12 inches at the back. So, you know, we like things big in America. Of course. And in New York, I mean, you got to see what's inside here. It is just the technology is incredible. Excuse the beeping, um, but you have full display screens. You have fire TV in this car. I mean, Nick, explain this. Yeah, Macintosh sound system, by the way, and you can only get that in your home as one of the highest end home systems. This has Macintosh. It has a passenger screen up front, massaging seats. Massaging seats. Absolutely. The purest of absolute luxury up front. Yeah. Even lights in the doors. And in the back, you mentioned it, fire TV. Now, this is the first vehicle to get full integrated fire TV. That means you can watch your Amazon Alexa back here, your Amazon TV. You have all that integration. Kids can be watching separate channels at the back with their headphones oh, on no. while, you know, parents are up front. Uh, in the front screen, you could do all that stuff like send destinations to the driver, order stuff from Amazon, you know, order foods. Anything I mean, like that. you got to see the space. It, it, it is the L for a reason. Yeah, absolutely. So that extra space at the back now, it gives you, it goes from like 27 cubic square feet at the back to 44 now in the L. And of course, we don't like to do things uh, you know, manually in America. We like to have switches for that. So, buttons. Yeah, yeah. Let me show you. We have a button here to lower the seats electronically. <laughs> so the seats go down electronically here at the back. And so you can push the button. You can camp out in this truck. Yes, absolutely. So this puts the third row down electronically, and then hopefully there's nobody sitting in the second row because the second row is a quick tip and fold. Ba-boom. There you go. How so. much does one of these cost? Well, they start around $109,000 okay. for the base version, but you know, that isn't only where it starts. So you can go up from there and then you want extra accoutrements. There's three different levels of off-roading and this really does off-road. Don't forget that this is the number one market in New York for Jeep. This is where more people buy Jeeps than any other state in the union. I mean, this is only slightly smaller than I think my first New York City studio apartment. This is incredible. One other thing, the self-cleaning stairs? Yes, yeah, so this, uh, the step that comes out here at the side is actually self-cleaning. So when you get mud or grime on it, it doesn't go into the car. When the step comes out, it cleans. I should point out one more thing here for you. You see the American flag here? Yes, Every yes. Jeep now has an American flag on the side. That is an honor to those that serve. So Jeep honors everybody that serves and the American flag is on every Jeep now. Incredible, literally the definition of luxury. Nick, thank you so much. This is just one of, again, hundreds of cars that you can see at the New York Auto Show. Reporting from inside the Javits Center, I'm Katie Corrado.